Good, good. At the very end, your cutoff was a little too subtle. Yeah. It could be just a little bit more obvious. Yeah, yeah. But, but we followed you. All right, many nice things. The very first thing was how you breathed at the beginning. That was great. Because I really felt like he was breathing. Well, he felt like he was breathing like a trombone player. Um, but that's good. Because that's what, you know, you've got here. But that kind of breathing for a large bore instrument will help for anybody. Okay? So, all right. That's great. That really just makes us feel confident at the beginning. Um, everything's really good. I thought for piano, um, you got us to play piano just because you were so centered overall. But... Some of the some of the pianos would be helpful if your hand started out higher, and then um, you kind of in forte you didn't do this. You had a nice uh, sort of gesture that went with the bar on the forte. I like that a lot, and it was like sustaining us to play into the notes instead of just. Bah. But on the piano, then it was kind of like do 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 do. do. So um, I think that's fine at the very end when it's piano for so long and there's no more changes. But in those measures where it's just two measures piano, two measures forte, I would keep your left hand still. And then, you know, if you don't get the result that you want, then we can't, then put your hand higher. It's okay for your hand to be high for the shush gesture. Make sense? All right, but many nice things. Try it again. <clears throat>